awesome. All right, everyone. So I hope you enjoyed Tarantula Feeding Video 134. Give a like uh, if you enjoyed it. Thanks for watching, and stay tuned for more videos. Uh, I think tomorrow I'll be recording the very first episode of Let's Play Resident Evil 7. Let's go tell Aunt Rhody that everyone is not dead. <laughs> Ooh, request. Smith Eye versus Hamori. To check that out. Oh, how cute. The Spoiler Man with Tarantula Dan. Hmm. It's a nice one. Thank you, Emmy. Better like that. Look at this guy. Arachnoboards. Ooh, DIY, an expensive arboreal sling enclosure with bonus candy. That could be a good one. Let's check it out. Fear Rocher, I just got one for Valentine's Day. Arboreal setup. Super glue, candy box, hinge, drill, pliers, handsaw, sandpaper, pin. Amazon.com. Mm -hmm. Acrylic hinges. Perfect. Add to cart and check out. All right, let's do this. March 15th, that's three days. This is going to be good. Okay, it's taken me some time, but I gathered everything together. I've got my Fiero Rocher, my trusty hinges, and my other materials that I already had together. I will show you what you will need is a Dremel tool, and then I went ahead and bought another easy kit of all the saw blades because I was low. I'm going to use a hot glue gun to glue the cork in. Got moss. I like to use a soldering gun to make the holes. That way it's easy to make small holes without cracking your container. Acrylic glue. The hinges I ordered. Safety goggles, of course. And then nets and tweezers and the things that I will use to move the animal over. Let's get started. Now this container, which by the way I love these, hazelnut is one of my favorite flavors. It has this texture on the front and obviously a large label. So what I decided to do was make this the back. It also has these handy lines in here that I'm going to follow for my cutting. So that's the two birds with one stone because I can kind of use this as a hide since it's not totally see-through in the back. My arboreal will probably appreciate that extra cover. Time to get cutting.
It's been 24 hours. My acrylic glue has had plenty of time to cure, so now I have the bottom glued together and the hinge in place. Now for the pretty little decoration and the rehousing. Oh, also to make the holes in the sides. Okay, so I'm just putting the final touches in now. Just putting a little bit of moss on the backboard here and along the bottom. Just so my uh, little arboreal has a fancy house to live in. Oh, and I wanted to thank Led Zeppelin on Arachnoboards for posting this super cool idea. You are the bomb. Super cool idea. Now all I need is my arboreal. I have a nice size Postlotheria rufolata here. Now most people would put this inside containers in case the animal runs off, but I'm not going to. Let's just try to sweet talk this baby in here. See what happens. There we go, sugar. Come on, look. Look at that fancy little log. Look at that. All for you. I do believe she approves. So I'm just going to close this up nice and tight and put my fancy little pin in here. Voila! Postlotheria rufolata in my handy dandy Fiera Rocher candy container. Passing on this Valentine's love. Hope you guys like this one. For more videos like it, make sure to comment, like, share, and subscribe. See you soon.